Hey! <laughs> Time, huh? Poor thing's got pests. Hello, ma'am. Daffy Duck, better than a shoe exterminator. I believe you're in need of our A1 Super Duper Pest Removal Services. I'm also in need of a tissue. Oh, please come in, come in. I've been having trouble with this monster for a while now. But this time it's gone too far. I must get rid of it before an accident happens. All right now, sister. If you'll just point me in the direction of this menacing little fellow, I'll take care of him lickety-split. Well, he's quite a devilish little monster. And what with all this machinery around here, I have to be very careful. Now, the last time I saw the little scamp, it was around here somewhere. Eww! No, no, no! It's over here! That horrible creature is over here! Quick! What? Quick, quick! It's up there! Get rid of this horrible beast before it hurts my poor little pets! Don't worry, ma'am! I'm on the case! That's precisely why I am worried! Hold it right there, Bob! Gotcha! I'm rich! I'm rich! <laughs> What's this? Someone's already trying to horn in on my riches! Ouch! Hey, what's going on? There's somebody living down here, you know. Hey, uh, excuse me. What's up, Doc? Uh, hello? Can you please tell me... Pardon me, sir, would you be so kind? Did you ever have one of those days when you felt invisible? Excuse me, Doc. Uh, can you help me with this? Hey, stop it! Wait, stop! Hmm, the suspense is killing me. I just gotta know where everybody's going in such a hurry. Well, hello. Don't you look like a nice little bunny rabbit? Would you like to help me? Well, I, uh... Of course you would. Come with me. Listen, lady, I I'd love to help you, but... Well, of course you'd love to help. That's the kind of rabbit you are. Warm, generous, giving. I can't disagree. Now, I had the misfortune to hire an exterminator who turned out to be nothing more than a silly, goofy Daffy. Duck. Oh, you know him. Well, anyway, he accidentally broke the time regulator, thereby disrupting time. During the explosion, he was hurled somewhere into another dimension with a time gem. This precious stone is the core of the time regulator. Oh, we must find that duck and recover the time gem. Yes, but... One more thing. We must also collect the precious gears of the time regulator. In the accident, they were scattered everywhere throughout time. The more gears we collect, the more stable the regulator will get. Do you understand? Eh, what's this we business? Oh, I'm sorry. Did I say we? Oh, silly me. Whew, that's better. Oh, no, no. Me, I can't go. Unfortunately, I must stay here to stabilize the time regulator as best as I can. But don't worry, my precious pet Tasmanian devil will go with you. I think I'd rather go alone. Oh, Granny's going to miss her little Tazzy boy. Yes, she is. Oh, brother. No, no, no. We mustn't eat the rabbit. Yeah, don't eat the rabbit. Okay, 
Mr. Bunny Rabbit. Time to go. Your first objective is quite simple. Go get ten gears scattered around here in this area. They are essential to open the Aztec era, your first destination. At this point of the game, help or hints are available. Just locate and touch my little Tweety Bird, and I'll get there immediately to give you a hand. Search and listen carefully. Oh, I almost forgot an essential item. Here, take this. This is a magic mirror. It'll be very useful during your time escapade. The mirror holder controls the camera. It is particularly useful if your friend gets out of your sight or gets too far. You can magically bring him back using the mirror. Watch the mirror icon to know who's holding it. It's also... <laughs> This one is strictly for bugs, because Taz is a little, well, primitive. <laughs> In the adventure, you'll encounter timed items like... In the adventure, you'll encounter timed items, like mallets or torches, for example, and most of them can be used by bugs only. You must hurry up when using them, otherwise... 